to present the Pola Narenska Award to Sandra Fortune. <laughs> So, Kathleen Brewington and Anthony Gittens. Um, I am going to tell a little bit about Polo. Kathleen is from Washington Performing Arts Society, and Anthony will do the honor to present the award. So, I danced with Polo for 12 years until her death, and she was a matriarch of dance in Washington, D.C. She was a modern dancer, soloist through Europe escaped the Nazi persecution, got to the United States after the war, came to Washington, D.C. at the suggestion of Doris Humphrey and Ted Sean, and really helped promote modern dance in the city. She actually worked with Doris Jones. Um, and so let me pass this to Kathleen, who will tell you a little bit about Washington Performing Arts that sponsors the award. Hi, good evening. I know uh, this is a very special, special um, occasion for us. It's Washington Performing Arts Society. Back in uh, 1978, May 4, we instituted a city dance festival which celebrated the dancers from the community and emerging and renowned in the city for the first time uh, in just celebrating what's so beautiful about dance in our city. And at that time, we were bringing, uh, let's see, Laverne Reed, um, we had Randall Cunningham, African Heritage Dancers and Drummers in Melbourne Deal, and many, many more. But what was very unique and special is that we were also highlighting cap the Capital um, Project here, the Capital Dance. Capital Ballet. Yeah, Capital Ballet. Um, and at that time, Doris Jones and Claire uh, Haywood were very prominent as artistic directors and very dear uh, friends of Mr. Wheeler, who is not here today, but I'm here on his behalf. And in that program, we uh, had Ebony, Ebony Concerto and three jazz pieces. And we were featuring a very young dancer at that time who happened to be Sandra, Sandra Fortune. <laughs> <laughs> so we especially feel very proud to be here tonight to honor Sandra for her accomplishments and her lifetime achievement in dance because we, at that time, were presenting her in her young career. And now we've come for a circle and are recognizing her for a lifetime achievement. So this is very special to us. And at this time, I'd like to um, at least introduce Tony, and then we'll read it back. Uh, I just want to take a couple of minutes to um, say why Sandra is here, accomplishments that she's had over these years. She developed her passion for the ballet at 11 years old as a student at the Jones Hayward School of Ballet under the tutelage of Doris Jones and Claire Harewood and Sylvester Campbell. Um, she was pushed to a higher level. She is today. She studied in New York City at the School of American Ballet, American Ballet Theater, and with the Joffrey Ballet in Washington. She studied at George Washington and Howard Universities. Ms. Fortune Green has been fe a featured soloist with the Washington Ballet, the Capitol Ballet Company, where she was the principal dancer. She has performed as a guest artist with Canada's Royal Winnipeg Ballet and the Santo Domingo Ballet in the Dominican Republic. Is it amazing? It's quite amazing. Sandra was the only African American in the second international ballet competition in Moscow in 1973. She also received honorable mention at the 7th and 8th International Ballet Competitions in Varna, Bulgaria. In recognition of Ms. Fortune Green's ongoing contribution to the world of dance in Washington, she has been awarded the Mayor's Arts Award for Excellence in an Artistic Discipline, the Certificate for Outstanding Artists presented by Mayor Walter Washington, Ward 4's 2010 Exceptional Woman of the Arts Award, the designation of Outstanding Alumnus by Howard University. Sandra is also an outstanding educator. From 1978 to 2012, she served as ballet mistress at the dance department of the Duke Ellington School of the Arts. 
Yes, yes. She currently teaches at the Ballou Senior High School as well as the Jones Hayward School of Ballet. In recognition of her achievements as a master teacher, Sandra was presented with the DC Public Schools 2010 Highly Effective Teacher Award. No dancer, no dancer has contributed more and is more deserving of this award. Sandra, I want you to know we're for you. Washington Performing Arts Society and the Poland Arenska Award Committee present the 2013 Poland Arenska Award to Sandra Fortune Green for lifetime achievement in dance. She served tirelessly to shape dance in the District of Columbia by performing and by raising generations of young dancers to their full potential. Congratulations, Sandra. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I am honored and humbled to be the president of the Poland Dance Award for 2013. Hello, okay. Um, <laughs> my profound gratitude and continuous love and support for my husband, Joseph Gruden. <laughs> The alumni, the board of directors, the dance faculty, parents, students, and friends of the Jones Haywood legacy, past, present, and future. My sincere thanks. My sincere thanks to the Washington Performing Arts Society for recognizing me and giving me this prestigious award. Thank you very much. by a special a guest choreographer, Sonia Dawkins, A Thousand Words. Thank you.